Did you wear your cap and gown? Did you leave your cap and gown? He's so romantic. He's always buying me flowers and treating me to dinner. He was so sweet and very protective. He just wanted to make sure I was safe. He is so cool. Sometimes he calls me names, but everyone does that. She texted me constantly, wondering where I was or who I was hanging out with. It's nice to be loved so much. I'm lucky to have someone totally dedicated to me, but sometimes I feel trapped. She hit me, but she apologized right after. He forced me to. Is it really my fault? He pushed me, but... We do that all the time. She spat in my face, but she apologized after. She choked me, but she was just angry. He punched me in my face. She hit me. Constantly she slapped me. me. He pushed me down. She texted just me constantly. Sure he, 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 he said he was sorry. She said he was sorry. He said he was sorry. Because I love him. She loves me. I love her.
my name is e Ezekiel and I currently attend Grand Prairie High School. Today I will be spitting some facts about my beloved country, Nigeria. First fact, Nigeria's Independence Day, October 1st, 1960, on my birthday. Isn't that beautiful? Also, Nigeria got its independence from British at Tofawa Belewa Square. Very interesting fact, Nigeria is split up into three. Nigeria has 30% Haja, 50% Igbo and 50% Yoruba. I guess what? Your boy is part of the Yoruba tribe. Best tribe out there. You have anything? Okay, okay, okay. I know, I know it's a lot of facts thrown at you, but let me give you one more. Nigeria, after I got independence from 1960 to 1970, was known as the largest country of producing rubber, palm oil and granuts also known as peanuts in this this country so i'm sorry my friends but i have to go that concludes my presentation my name is ezekiel Uwemimon, and i am part of the african american stories shout out to miss cooper i will see you all later